uh, it took about two months to sculpt the, uh, the full-size piece. It's a Bronco. It's going to Fayetteville State University in Fayetteville, North Carolina, and it's their school mascot. Uh, well, the metalwork is finished, and we're doing patina, which is a chemical applied to the surface of the bronze to give it a color. The title of this piece is Defiant because he's uh, standing his ground. It's good to patina outside if you have a piece uh, that you're going to be displaying outside. Then you can actually see what it's going to look like. Sometimes if you do the patina indoors, it looks great. You bring it out in the sunlight, it looks totally different. So it's better to patina an outdoor piece outside. And around the ankle too, and then that little fur around the... That looks good. After we get this part done, then the really cool part starts. They got these huge torches they heat this thing up with. Oh, look at that. The metal doesn't take the patina unless it's hot. It's a little chilly. Uh, we're casting the piece in uh, Loveland, Colorado. Uh, a lot of good foundries in the area, uh, known for their bronze work. And uh, it'll be, uh, when it's finished, it'll be shipped to North Carolina. Ooh. I was saying we could blue pad just the muscles to make it really look muscular, you know. Uh, There's a lot involved in this, and if you, if you have a, a person doing the patina that's a real artist, uh, he can bring a lot to the piece. If you don't have a person who's a real artist, they can destroy a piece real easy. It's like putting a bad paint job on a Ferrari. It's the challenge is to capture the character of the school uh, and the mascot somehow. Another challenge was to make the horse look fierce, uh, you know, the expression, uh, all has to do with the face, so you want to make it intimidating and uh, you want to make it, uh, give it that don't mess with us look, you know, for opposing teams when they come into play. This is going to bring out the metallic quality of the bronze, so you can see it through the patina. So I like to see the, the qualities of the metal coming through the color. To me, it gives a lot of life to the piece. see the whole thing just kind of come together. I think it captures the spirit of, uh, of a bronca. I think it's, uh, it has a lot of nice lines in it. Uh, I think it's, uh, it has a lot of energy. Uh, and it's, the uh, texturing on the surface is very active, so it gives a lot of movement to the piece. It makes your eye travel over the surface of the piece, which makes it more interesting. It's looking good, man. Like it? Love it. The more interesting it is, the longer you can look at it, and the longer you look at it, the more you love it, so you can enjoy it a lot longer. That's the idea. That looks really good right there. the light.